Welcome back. Today we're talking about Samsung's upcoming flagship, the Galaxy S26 Ultra, and why it could be one of the most impressive leaps we've seen in years. I'm not just reading out a list of features. I want you to understand how these changes will actually feel in your day-to-day -day life, from the way you game and record video to how often you reach for your charger. At its heart is the new Snapdragon 8 Elite Gen 2, built by TSMC, pushing insane clock speeds and delivering graphics that could give handheld consoles a run for their money. But what really unlocks its potential is the RAM. We're talking LPDDR5X running at 10.7 gigabits per second. If that number doesn't mean much to you, here's the bottom line. It's faster than anything Samsung has put in a phone before, matching Micron's latest chips, and it's about 20% more power efficient. That means your phone can juggle heavy apps, massive games, and high race video without choking or overheating. It means when you switch between your photo editor and your game, there's no pause, no hesitation. When you tap to preview a massive image, it just opens instantly. And all that speed comes without draining your battery as quickly as before. Picture recording 8K video at your kid's birthday. Normally, the moment you zoom or switch lenses, there's a little stutter, maybe a drop in quality. On the S26 Ultra, everything stays buttery smooth, or think about gaming on the go. You're getting consistently high frame rates without the phone turning into a space here. Apps reopen exactly where you left them, and multitasking feels effortless. It's not just about the inside. We're hearing about slimmer bezels, a slightly bigger screen without making the phone awkward to hold and possibly charging speeds up to 60 watts. That is the kind of power where a quick coffee stop could give you nearly half a charge. Combine that with more efficient internals and you're looking at a phone that can actually last a full day of heavy use. Camera fans aren't left out. Early leaks suggest a refined 200 megapixel sensor, better telephoto range, and AI tools that help you get pro-looking shots without extra editing. Night shots could be cleaner, zoom transitions smoother, and focusing smarter. If even most of these rumors are true, the S26 Ultra could set a new standard for Android flagships. So my question to you is this, what would make you call a phone the best you've ever owned? Battery life, camera magic, sheer speed? Let me know in the comments, and don't forget to stick around for when the full story breaks.